Good morning, Grand Community. Good morning, my elders. Good morning, stakeholders in Grand Ecosystem. Today is the 15th of July, 2024. I had promised you that if this buzzword do not start in 48 hours time, I will either come up to address the ecosystem once again to either continue with the, uh, the exposure of the masquerade called the government committee. Now is 44 hours after the automaton, four hours into the time being 12 o'clock today being 15th of uh, july monday i have not seen anything but i want to appreciate all the elders who reach out to me four prominent elders in grand ecosystem reach out to me to uh, ask me to support and give them a little more time this was due to uh, the weekend my automaton came during the weekend and could not give them the ample space to do what was needful but as you kindly appeal to my people the poor masses of nigeria to hold on and give them uh, at least two working days ladies and gentlemen i remain your brother and friend reverend moses from abuja the time now is eight o'clock the 15th day of july 2024 I want to appreciate the Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, President Ahmed Bola Tunubu, and his Vice President, Alhaji Shetima, who have seen the pains of the poor masses and have decided that the poor masses should breathe. Your Excellency, I appreciate you, sir. May the Lord Almighty and long of it your life to end your tenure in good health and sound mind i respect you sir after traveling 31 states and the federal capital in nigeria i salute the vigor the strength the capacity the made you went around the 36 states of the federation and the fct campaigning for the poor masses to vote you out of the 36 states the 31 states are visited i know what it means to travel from here to gamborungala to banki to mubi to mambila hills to elela in sokoto to shaki in uh, uh, oyo state to badagri to cross the river to Boni, all over the nations, I can see it is a rigorous journey. Very hectic, but in your age, you went around canvassing for votes that was casted to bring you into power. And you saw that this place is vast and they needed assistance. Two weeks ago, the punch paper brought out the caption of the federal government budgeting and approving palliative in hundreds of billions to the poor masses of Nigeria. So this is uh, noticeable actions you've taken in this country to help and to caution the effects of hunger and poverty. May the Lord continue to give you grace even as you approve the disbursement of UAG 
We pray that the Almighty God will bless you and keep you. I want to appreciate our supporters from Lagos, Kanu, Borno, Enugu, Adamawa, Portakot, Imo, Benin, Ibadan, Sokoto, Jos, Kaduna, and the Niger Delta. I appreciate all stakeholders from all this environment who have reached out to me, who are ready to show their solidarity in all aspects of it. SARS and MARS, I am grateful. I remain indebted and pledge to be the voice of the poor masses of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, to tell them the truth, nothing but the truth, to bring the updates to their doorsteps. I want to appreciate every stakeholder that reached out to me to ask for self-peddling. I appreciate you for considering our voice to be a voice of the people. I appreciate your resilience. I appreciate your work. And I want to also appeal to the government committee to appreciate these elders because if not for them, we wouldn't have listened to any other thing short of these people. I want to also uh, uh, announce that we want to soft pedal and allow at least two days, two working days, that is Monday and Tuesday, to give room for uh, Comrade Pascal Anyaun's led a press conference which is expected to hold on Wednesday if nothing happens. After the press conference on Wednesday, if nothing happens, we will go ahead with our preparations. But because I've traversed the length and breadth of this country, I've understand from stakeholders and for everybody who have reached out to me that we need to carry the poor masses along. And these poor masses are people who do not have Android phones like me and you, who will join us to know these people who have decided that the poor masses of this country will not breathe. Having said that, as a mass, we have decided to carry all subscribers along in our demonstration or in our agitation. We shall be assembling the contacts of this government committee who will harden their hearts not to do the needful. We shall be displaying their pictures on placards. That is, we are talking about leaving the uh, social media and graduating to print media. Print them as a team, print their contacts, their families, and display them and let the poor masses photocopy it. Photocopy is just 15 naira, in which every poor man in Nigeria can afford 15 naira to photocopy the contacts and the pictures of these people. And we shall be titling these placards, these pictures, them say. Not them. Not them. Them say. Written on it, not them them say going with the song not them them say not them them say what do they say the poor man will not rest what do they say the poor man will not eat what do they say the poor man will not get the blessing of god what did they say they say that this development will not happen please all stakeholders if you know you are your hand is involved in the delay of this God sent blessing to Nigerians. Don't be surprised that your pictures will be displayed in our market squares. Uh, the Okada riders will be carrying these placards, these posters. The Kekena peps will be carrying these posters. I will be displaying your pictures all over this nation. Don't be surprised. With a caption, them say. What did they say? The poor man will not rest. What did they say? The president have not done well. What did they say? We shall die. What did they say? 
then you add whatsoever you want to add. Them say, in the north, we shall be having the caption, Sunche, Mesukache, Sunche, Bezemorayuba, Mesukache, Sunche, Mushahula Kanchi, Mesukache, Sunche, Suwa, Sune, Suwa, Nene, Sune, Sune, Suka, Hana Musekewa, Suwa, Nene, Sune. We shall be carrying these placards, we shall be carrying these pictures with this caption. Nobody should go out. Nobody should make noise. Let our papers make the noise for us. When they ask you, what do they say? Them say. Who say? Not them. Not them say. What do they say? Not them. What do they say? Not them. What do they say? Not them. Children, come out. As you are done, what do they say? Not them. Not them, them. What do they say? Not them. We are going to be acting very seriously. Daybreak on Thursday. After the Wednesday ultimatum by 12 midnight. From 12 midnight on Wednesday after the press conference down to Thursday is going to be a Passover. It's going to be a Passover night. When you wake up, you see your pictures everywhere in the social media, in the market squares, in our villages. Posters will be littered. Photocopy will be later. Those who cannot print posters will do photocopy of all your contacts and all your pictures and will be littered in all our villages. Because most of our subscribers do not have Android phone like I and you. Therefore, the print media is going to be used to display your pictures and your contacts. Ladies and gentlemen, grand community, elders and stakeholders, I wish we would not get to that point. I salute the courage of the country director of UAG, His Excellency, Ambassador, Professor, Apostle Ken Wakama, who have endured the bullets, who have endured the stones, who have endured the noise, Sir, I covet your courage, I covet your standing, I covet your strength, I covet your patience. You are not just big for nothing, you are big for something, sir. I, I admire you, sir. May the Lord strengthen us and give us victory as the poor masses of Nigeria have a space to breathe. Once again, I remain your brother and friend, Reverend Moses from Abuja saying every stakeholders all our supporters should come down and wait until if the government committee will allow the press conference to be heard on wednesday god bless you good morning and god bless